So today in this video, we're going to be seeing how Ari Gr Ariana Grande is in red. Um, and you know that the devil always in red. They playing as the devil. And a lot of old school videos, rock, uh, country music videos, you always see artists in red. Even in new school videos, it's always in red. It's always showing the, showing you the devil. So we all have to bust down this Ariana Grande video. One time on Twitter, I heard Ariana was pregnant. So I got pregnant so we could be pregnant at the same time. See? Right there. That's idol worship. Idol worship send you to hell. You know, Yah Yahweh want all your uh undivided attention, not no no uh his creation. But let's get into her. See how she said um Oh, your her favorite celebrity got pregnant, so I want to get pregnant too. Promoting sex, promoting sex out of marriage, promoting to sleep with anybody just to get pregnant because your favorite artist getting pregnant. You know, uh, basically following following a trend, being like everybody else. This is a spell. She's sending a spell to these women and men. Like I made that R. Kelly sex scandal video. They they sexualizing these people to um, have kids and have children. It's a sex spell in their songs. So she be promoting this little girl. They are they showing you how the big influence they got on these her day fans and how they got them on mind control. And these everyday people that go to school, go to college, and they really brainwashing mind control people to believe a certain thing, to follow a certain thing. And some people say, oh, I don't know why I like her. I just liked her. You don't know why she liked her because it's it's a spell. You know, you know what I'm saying? As soon as you turn on that song or hear that beat, it's it's like a zap. Got you. You know what I'm saying? So you got to be careful when you listen to these people because it's, they are, it's like a remote. They just got you as soon as you listen to her sing. Let's keep going. Turns out it was just a rumor. See, turns out it was just a rumor. So now they showing you, oh, yeah, she started, she don't want the baby. It's promoting mothers that don't want their baby, putting their babies in the microwave, giving their babies away, abortion. Abortion is killing the baby. That's up to the devil. So if, you have, if you're doing abortion, you need to stop because you're on your way to hell. You need to repent for that. You're killing innocent people. And some people don't think nothing wrong with it. You know, people say, oh, you had the baby's going to mess up your life. No, you deal with it. And that baby, if you don't, if you don't, then that baby going to be, you know, on on your life on judgment day. Because you're killing innocent people. Ain't no different from killing the baby um, than killing somebody that's 20, 30, or 40 years old. Murder is murder. Ariana Grande told me my hair looks sexy pushback. She's not wrong. Ariana broke up. See, talking about... Um, they, see that gay was kind of giving off gay vibes, you know, f uh, feminine vibes, you know, take taking uh, Ariana Grande opinion on how he should look, what he where he should dress, what you should do. This was this TV programming. You know, these idols are programming you to look a certain way, worship a certain way, wear certain colors, wear some makeup, eyeliner, lipstick, nail polish, shoes, wardrobe, saggy pants. You know what I'm saying? Real jewelry. They telling you this is how you use a dress. Baby, basically controlling your mind, telling you how you should run, how, how you should do your life. And you think, you know, you got control of your life and you're doing your, doing your life the right way, but you're not. Your life is based on whatever idol or person you listen to or you worship and see, whether they're on the food channel or not, or somewhere else in the world. You don't even got to be people. It could be your mom, dad, auntie, cousin, anybody. You see, they got this, uh, this like she male right here with long hair, giving off gay feminine vibes. You know, guy, guy looking, looking ungay. Off an engagement, so I found a guy to propose to me, and I broke off an engagement. See, look, look how wicked all these people are. Just completely wicked, and the devil is attacking anybody that's not with Yah, Yah, Yahweh. Anybody that's not with Christ, he's attacking you. He's getting you in there. He's going to get you in there. He's attacking anybody. He's searching like a word line. He's looking at all these people not worshiping Yahweh. 
He know the people who he can't touch because they got angels surrounding. None of these people, half of the people here don't have angels protecting them at all. So anything goes with the devil. Your life is in the, the devil's hand. If you decide for you to get in a car accident and you die, that, that's it. Your life gone. You're going to hell. That's it. You, you should have repented and did God's will before, you know, before you heard the message. The devil got control over everybody that's not worshiping Yahweh. It's just plain and simple. And now you got her uh, copying Ariana Grande. She broke off her boyfriend or marriage and stuff like that. And so they imitate that. They, 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 they trick people into being in love with them. Trick people into engaging with them. And go to the altar and break it up. Or get engaged and break it up. And break that person's heart. Now that person turning evil because they got heartbroken. And they don't know how to deal with and cope with the hurt. And why that person did them like that. These are nothing but demons that setting the relationships up. Getting people engaged and breaking it. Have have people say, oh, yeah, I want to marry and get engaged with you and keep all these promises. I promise I want to do this and keep playing around with your emotions and feelings. These are what these demons do. That's why a lot of people in society get their feelings played with, their emotions played with. It's not the demons playing around. Just want to break you. Just want to hit you. You know what I'm saying? Whether you kill yourself or not. The point of it is they can keep breaking you without you noticing it. And you only notice it when you really become heartless and you do somebody else the wrong way. You're like, man, I really, I'm really as evil, man. I really tore that person up. You know what I'm saying? And some people can't forgive themselves, so they stuck with that person that they just became, the evil person. I heard she's a lesbian now and dating some chick called See, Aubrey. feminine. Gay guy. fucking sick. I heard if you record her snoring and play it backwards, it sounds like Fantasia. See, now you got all these people that's worn, that's gossiping on social media. Oh, what Ariana Grande doing? What um, Molly Cyrus doing? Oh, what they, well, who they dating? Who they kissing? What they dressing? Who they going to Red Card? What song they singing? The obsessiveness of idol worship. This is idol worship. Ariana says, honest to God, knock me out. Look at this fake clone, Ariana. Now you got this girl that's dressing up like Ariana. You got the same ponytail, same makeup, same um, uh, skin texture, eyebrow, eyes, and stuff like that. Ears, look at them big old ears. I, I wouldn't be surprised, you know. Ariana's a boy anyway, and this is a boy also. So I decided to punch myself in the face. See what I'm saying? Promoting undeath, promoting hurt, promoting suicidal. And these why these kids, the suicidal rate is outrageous. Because this is promoting bulliness. You know, they saying, all right, and they, they tell me if Ariana show a video on Snapchat, her hitting herself with a, with a, with a baseball bat. Or hitting her hand on a punch in the refrigerator, people start doing it. Oh, oh, we got we got a new um challenge. Hit the refrigerator as you can. How many times can you hit the refrigerator until until you can't hit it no more? Promoting suicidal. It was awesome. You know what I'm saying? And, and they loving it. And you talking? And then she okay? It's going to be video. And he talking about thank you next. This Ariana Grande is fake. This a straight mannequin. Ariana Grande, if you don't know, got multitudes of clones, multitudes of her. Whatever they doing in the lab, hologram, whatever. This is a fake Ariana Grande. Fake all the way. It's multitudes of Ariana Grande on these videos. And you be like, oh, why would they want to do something like that? It make they make their job harder. These jobs is a piece of cake to them. These movies are a piece of cake to them. Every clip they got a different Ariana Grande. She looked different every time. Same thing with Nicki Minaj. Different clips. Just switching them off the um back room. Now she got now she promoting this popularity crap, making people jealous of her. Because she walking down the hallway like she miss I miss I miss Queen in here. Promoting jealousy. Promoting oh I wanna be like that. I wanna walk I wanna walk down here. And here you go right here. Let's get to right here. Did they pass the stage? I think they passed the stage. Well, right here, showing Ayanna Grande on stage with a short skirt, promoting stripping, promoting sexuality, show your skin more. Of course, she ain't red because it's the, it's the devil. Christmas tree worshiping on uh, Christmas. The scriptures uh, clearly said the pagan people cut down trees and decorated with silver and gold. Christmas worship, making people worship Christmas. And she crying about her ex. Talking about thank you next. Like he ain't nothing. I'm on to the next dick. That's basically what she's saying. 
Basically on the next day. See, you always in red. The devil always in red. Got pyramids on in the chili, man. And why they chewing this chili? A chili is not but a beginning sluttery. I'm sorry. Like, you might have to get your kids out of that, um, chili in them basketball games, chili in them football games, whether it's, uh, um, NFL, whether it's college, whatever. Chili, that's what they're showing. Look at them, the, like, legs spread it out. Pyramids. They like that. Chili here is slutting because what do they do? That strippers do. Throw their legs up behind their head, do splits. You can see their panties when they do different moves, twerking, um, doing all sorts of uh, stuff that women not supposed to be doing, promoting stripping, promoting clubs. That's why they got these chili. Get your kids out of cheerleader. Cheerleaders got on these short um, dresses and skirts and stuff like that. And these young young kids doing it, five-year-olds, six-year-olds, seven-year-olds, thinking it's cool. Right here is a different young different um grind it right here that's a different one look how she walking walking like a robot watch this part she walking like a straight robot like she like bouncing up and down different ariana grande right here totally different now she got this magical box and i can't remember what movie it is but i think that it was what i think it's called 16 to 21 16 again or something like that you one of the white um actors wanted to be 21 she wanted to be older or something because i can't think what that movie is but she had this little fairy magical box and she shook the box and it like the box glitter fell on her head and um she got older she became more grown and had a successful and she woke up the next day like five or four years older or something like that i think it was like 35 or something i can't remember that movie it just came off the top of my head you guys so that's why i can't that's what that's why I can't uh, think about what movie it is. Yeah, promoting idol worship. So let's listen to this part right here. It's really big. See right here, she said, "Yeah, his he he was really big." Like like she did, she tried to slid that on there. Like I, we could, I couldn't hear that talking about his dick. Tomo, yeah, he was really big. You know what I'm saying? Then she go on talking about uh, being sarcastic, talking about, oh, yeah, his tooth or something like that. She talking about sexual. Ariane has sent so many people to hell because of her beauty. Her beauty, she got a spill red all over right here when she was working out. Different on the different on grind day. When she was running on that treadmill right here. Different one. Tony, she got like three, three, three clones. Promoting Christmas, promoting slutty, doing falling down, doing splits. And she knew, and she know girls gonna start wanting to be like her. Get in the same ponytail with her. Go go get a little Mexican, Puerto Rican tan, whatever she mixed with, one of those two. Um, all that stuff. She know it ain't gonna copy her. And they pushing her hard. You know. Especially if she got the uh, Kim Kardashian and mom and her family, the she male. You already know it's evil. Pyramids in the snow, everything. We get it. That's the end of the video. You know, uh, pay close attention to the colors, the purples, and the red. The devil always come red. But until then, you see me next video.